It was fortunate that Hildebrand was able to get the works away from the city of Dresden, given what was about to happen. With the Allies approaching, the firebombing of Dresden provided him with an ideal cover story. We had a home in Dresden, um, and actually his street was bombed, so I think Hildebrand saw it as a very obvious and clear solution to their hoard. I think they just said, you know, our street was bombed, all the records have gone, all the art's gone, we don't have anything, we have no letters, we've got nothing. And it made complete sense because it was actually bombed and no one knew that I think Hildebrand had actually taken the art out at the very, very last minute when the Allies were approaching. So there was no reason really why it wouldn't be true that it was bombed. Hildebrand Gerlit had another secret, though. He had been hired to find works of art for Hitler himself and in the process had greatly expanded his own collection. His pretense that it had all been destroyed in Dresden was successful. 